Strike all after the enacting clause and insert the following. Section 1, short title. This act may be cited as the Emergency National Security Supplemental Appropriations Act 2024. Section 2, Table of Contents. The Table of Contents of this Act is as follows. Short title, Table of Contents, References. Division A, National Security Supplemental Appropriations Act 2024. Division B, Board of Security and Combating Fentanyl. Supp Supplemental Appropriations Act 2024. Division C, Border Act. Section 3, References. Except as expressly provided otherwise, any reference to this Act contained in any division of this act shall be treated as referring only to the provisions of that division. Division A, National Security Supplemental Appropriations Act 2024. The following sums are appropriated out of any money in the Treasury not otherwise appropriated for the fiscal year ending September 30, 2024, and for other purposes, namely. Title I, Department of Defense, Military Personnel, Military Personnel, Army. For an additional amount for Military Personnel, Army, $207 million to remain available until December 2024, to respond to the situation in Ukraine for, and for related expenses, provided that such amount is designated by the Congress as being an emergency requirement pursuant to Section 251 of the Balanced Budget and Emergency Deficit Act, Control Act of 19... For an additional amount for military personnel, Army, $207 million to remain available until December 31st, 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses, provided that such amount is designated by the Congress as being for an emergency requirement pursuant to Section 251B2AI of the Balanced Budget and Emergency Deficit Control Act of 1985. Military Personnel Marine Corps. For an additional amount for Milita Military Personnel Marine Corps, $3.5 million to remain available until December 31st, 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. That such amount is designated by con Congress as being for an emergency requirement pursuant to Section 251, Balanced Budget, and Emergency Deficit Control Act of 1985. Military Personnel Air Force, for an additional amount of $23.3 million to remain available till December 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Military Personnel Space Force, $4.2 million to remain available until December 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Operation and Maintenance Army, an additional amount of $4.9 billion to remain available until December 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Operation and Maintenance Navy, an additional amount of $1.5 billion to remain available until December 31st, 2024, to respond to the situation in Ukraine, to support improvements to the submarine industrial base, and for related expenses. Provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $976 million shall be to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Provided further that of the total amount provided under the heading in this section, $560 million to remain available until September 30, 2024 shall be to support improvements to the submarine industrial base and for related expenses. Operation and Maintenance Marine Corps, an additional amount of $69 million to remain available until December 2024 
to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Operation and Maintenance, Air Force. An additional amount, $847 million to remain available until December 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Operation and Maintenance, Space Force. An additional amount, $8.5 million to remain available until December 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine. Operation and Maintenance, Defense-Wide. An additional amount, $34.2 billion to remain available until December 31st, 2024 to respond to the situations in Israel, Iraq, and Taiwan and for related expenses. Provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $13.77 billion to remain available until September 30, 2025 shall be for the Ukraine Security Assistance Initiative. Provided further, that such fund for the Ukraine Security Assistance Initiative shall be available to the Secretary of Defense under the same terms and conditions as are provided for under this heading in the additional Ukraine Supplemental Appropriations Act 2023 and shall be available notwithstanding Section 8135 of the Department of Defense Appropriations Act 2023 or any similar provisions in any other act making appropriations for the Department of Defense. Provided further, that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, up to $4.4 billion to remain available until September 2025 may be transferred to accounts under the heading Operations and Maintenance, Procurement, Revolving, and Management Funds for replacement through new procurement or repair of existing unserviceable equipment of defense articles from the stock of the Department of Defense and for reimbursement for defense services of the Department of Defense and Military Education Training provided to or identified for provision to the Government of Israel or to foreign countries that have provided support to Israel at the request of the United States. Provided for further, that up to $13.4 billion to remain available until September 2025 may be transferred to accounts under the heading Operation and Maintenance, Procurement and Revolving and Management Funds for replacement through new procurement or repair of existing unserviceable equipment of defense articles from the stock of the Department of Defense and for reimbursement for defense services of the Department of Defense and military education training provided to or identified for provision to the government of Ukraine or to foreign countries that have provided support to Ukraine at the request of the United States. Provided further, that up to $1.9 billion to remain available until September 2025 may be transferred to accounts under the heading Operation and Maintenance Procurement and Revolving and Management Funds for replacement through new procurement or repair of existing unserviceable equipment of defense articles from the stock of the DOD and for reimbursement for defense services of the DOD and military education training provided to or identified per for provision to the government of Taiwan or to foreign countries that have provided support to Taiwan at the request of the United States. Provided further that funds transferred pursuant to the preceding three provi provisos shall be merged with and available for the same purpose and for the same time period as the appropriations to which the funds are transferred. That the Secretary of Defense shall notify the Congressional Defense Committee of the details of such transfer not less than 15 days before any such transfer. Provided further, that upon a determination that all or part of the funds transferred from this appropriation are not necessary for the purpose provided herein, such amount may be transferred back and merged with this appropriation. Provided further, that any transfer authority provided herein is in addition to any other transfer authority provided by law. Procurement, Missile Procurement Army. 
additional amount, $2.74 billion, to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Procurement of am ammunition, Army, additional amount, $6.4 billion, to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Israel and Ukraine for and for related expenses. Provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $801 million shall be to respond to the situation in Israel and for related expenses. Provided further, that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $5.6 billion shall be to respond to the situation in Ukraine and for related expenses. Other procurement, Army. Additional amount, $309 million to, re to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Weapon procurement, Navy. Additional amount, $707 million to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Shipbuilding and conversion, Navy. Additional amount, two point. $1.6 billion to remain available till September 2028 to support improvements to the submarine industrial base and related expenses, provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, shall the funds shall be available as follows. Columbia class submarine AP, $1,955,000,000. Virginia class submarine AP, $200,000,000. Under the procurement, Navy, additional amount, $320 million to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine to support improvements to the submarine industrial base and related expenses, provided that of the total amount provided under this heading of this act, $26 million shall be to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses, provided further that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $294 million shall be to support improvements to the main marine submarine industrial base and related expenses. Procurement, Marine Corps, additional amount, $212 million to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Missile Procurement Air Force, additional amount $366 million to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Other Procurement Air Force, additional amount $2.8 billion to remain available until 2020, September 2026 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and other related expenses. Procurement Defense-wide, additional amount $5.25 billion to remain available until September 2026 to respond to the situations in Israel and Ukraine and related expenses, provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $4 billion shall be for the Secretary of Defense to provide to the government of Israel for the procurement of the Iron Dome and David's Sling defense system to counter short-range rocket threats, provided further that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $1.2 billion shall be for the Secretary of Defense to provide to the Government of Israel for the procurement of the Iron Beam defense system to counter short-range rocket threats, provided further that funds in the preceding provisos shall be transferred pursuant to an exchange of letters and are in addition to funds provided pursuant to the U.S.-Israel Iron Dome Procurement Agreement as amended. Provided further, that nothing under this heading in this act shall be construed to apply to amounts made available in prior appropriations acts for the procurement of the Iron Dome and David's Sling defense system or for the procurement of the Iron Beam defense system. Provided further, that in the total amount provided under this heading of this act, $46.8 million shall be to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Defense Production 
Act purchases additional amount $331 million to remain available until expended for activities by the DOD pursuant to sections 108, 301, 302, and 303 of the Defense Production Act 1950. Provided that such amount shall be obligated and expended by the Secretary of Defense as if delegated the necessary authorities conferred by the Defense Production Act of 1950. Research, Development, Test, and Evaluation, Army. A additional amount, $18.6 million, to remain available until September 2025 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Research, Development, Test, and Evaluation, Navy. Additional amount, $20.8 million, to remain available until September 2025 to respond to the situation in Ukraine to support improvements to the submarine industrial base and related expenses, provided that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $13.8 million shall be to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses, provided further that of the total amount provided under this heading in this act, $7 million shall be to support improvements to the submarine industrial base and for related expenses. Research, Development, Test, and Evaluation Air Force. Additional amount, $407 million to remain available until September 2025 to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses. Research, Development, Test, and Evaluation Defense-wide. Additional amount, $194 million to remain available until September 2025 to respond to the situation in Ukraine. Other Department of Defense Programs, Office of the Inspector General, additional amount, $8 million to remain available until December 2024, which shall be for operation and maintenance of the Office of the Inspector General, including the Special Inspector General for Operation Atlantic Resolve to carry out reviews of the activities of the DOD to execute funds appropriately appropriated in this act, including assistance provided to Ukraine, provided that the Inspector General of the DOD shall provide to the Congressional Defense Committees a briefing not later than 90 days after the date of the enactment of this act. Related agencies, Intelligence Community Management Account, additional amount $2 million to remain available until September 2024 to respond to the situation in Ukraine. General provisions, this title, including transfers of funds. Section 101A, upon the determination of the Secretary of Defense that such action is necessary in the national interest, the Secretary may, with the approval of the Director of the Office of Management and Budget, transfer up to $1 billion only between the appropriations or funds made available to in this title to the DOD to respond to the situation in Ukraine and related expenses, provided that the Secretary shall notify the Congress promptly of each transfer made pursuant to the authority in this subsection. Provided further, that such authority is in addition to any transfer authority otherwise provided by law in this sub subject Provided further that such authority is in addition to any transfer authority otherwise provided by law and is subject to the same terms and conditions as the authority provided in Section 8005 of the DOD Appropriations Act of 2023 or any similar provisions in any subsequent act making appropriations for the DOD for fiscal year 2024, except for monetary limitations concerning the amount of authority of authority available. Section B, upon the determination of the Director of National Intelligence that such action is necessary in the national interest, the Director may, with the approval of the Director of the Office of Management and Budget, transfer up to $250 million only between the appropriations or funds made available in this title for the National Intelligence Program. Provided 
that the Director of National Intelligence shall notify the Congress promptly of all transfers made pursuant to the authority in this subsection. Provided further, that such authority is in addition to any transfer authority otherwise provided by law and is subject to the same transferring con conditions as the authority provided in Section 8093 of the DOD Appropriations Act 2023 or any similar provisions in any subsequent act making appropriations for the DOD for fiscal year 2024, except for monetary limitations concerning the amount of authority available. Section 102. Not later than 60 days after the date of enactment of this act, the Secretary of Defense, in coordination with the Secretary of State, shall submit a report to the Committee on Appropriations, Armed Services, and Foreign Affairs of the House of Representatives and the Committee on Appropriations, Armed Services, and Foreign Relations of the Senate on measures being taken to account for United States defense articles designated for Ukraine since February 24, 2022. Russian invasion of Ukraine, particularly measures with regard to such articles that require enhanced end use monitoring measures to ensure that the such articles reach their intended recipients and are used for the intended purposes and any other measures to prompt accountability for the use of such articles provided that such report shall include a description of any occurrences of articles not reaching their intended recipients or used for their intended purposes and a description of any remedies taken. Provided further, that such report shall be submitted in unclassified form, but may be accompanied by a classified annex. Section 103. Not later than 30 days after the date of enactment of this act, and every 30 days thereafter through fiscal year 2025, the Secretary of Defense, in coordination with the Secretary of State, shall provide a written report to the Committees on Appropriations, Armed Services, and Foreign Affairs of the House of Representatives and the Committees of Appropriations, Armed Services, and Foreign Relations of the Senate describing United States security assistance provided to Ukraine since February 24, 2022, Russia's invasion of Ukraine, including a compre comprehensive list of the defense articles and services provided to Ukraine, and the associated authority and funding used to provide such articles and services provided that such report shall be submitted in unclassified form, but may be accompanied by a classified annex. Section 104, for an additional amount for the Department of Defense, $2.44 billion to remain available until September 2024 for transfer to military personnel accounts, operations and maintenance accounts, procurement accounts, research development, test and evaluation accounts, and the Defense Working Capital Fund, in addition to amounts otherwise made available for such pur purposes, only for U.S. operations, force protection, deterrence, and the replacement of combat expenditures in the United States Central Command Region, provided that none of the funds provided under this section may be obligated or expended until 30 days after the Secretary of Defense provides to the Congressional Defense Committees an execution plan. Provided further, that not less than 15 days prior to any transfer of funds, the Secretary of Defense shall notify the Congressional Defense Committees of the details of any such transfer. Provided further, that upon transfer, the funds shall be merged with and available for the same purposes and for the same time period as the appropriation to which tra transferred. Provided further, that any such transfer authority provided herein is in addition to any other transfer authority provided by law. Section 105, for an additional amount of the Department of Defense, $542 million to remain available until September 2024 for transfer to operations and maintenance accounts, procurement accounts, and research development test and evaluation accounts, 
in addition to amounts otherwise made available for such purpose only for unfunded pro priorities of the United States Indo-Pacific Command for fiscal year 2024 as submitted by Congress pursuant to Section 1105 of Title 31, United States Code. Provided that none of the funds provided under this section may be obligated or expended till 30 days after the Secretary of Defense, through the U.S. Secretary of Defense Comptroller, provides the Committee on Appropriations of the House of Representatives and the Senate a detailed execution plan for such funds. Provided further, that not less than 15 days prior to any transfer of funds, the Secretary of Defense shall notify the con Congressional Defense Committees of the details of any such transfer. Provided further, that upon transfer, the funds shall be merged with and available for the same purposes and for the same time period as the appropriation to which transferred. Provided further, that any transfer authority provided herein is in addition to any other transfer authority provided by law. 